Hi everyone, so I have another haul video to do today and that is because I went down to Joanne Fabrics because they were having some doorbuster sales and um, they had flannel 70% off which is an amazing deal and I am needing flannel to make more cloth diapers and cloth diaper inserts for Peyton since she's outgrowing the ones that I had already made for her so I thought it was a perfect opportunity to get some really great priced flannel and um, while I was there I bought a couple other things and so I thought I would show it to you all today. I'm going to start off by showing the remnants that I got which is the first thing I headed for when I got to the store and that's because the way Joanne Fabrics does remnants is whatever the current price of that type of fabric is, uh, whether it's on sale or not, you get an additional 50% off. So if something is on sale already and then you get 50 more percent off, it, you can get some really great deals. Um, so yeah, I will go ahead and show those. The first one I got is this fleece and it's really cute. It has a fox and a squirrel and um, fleece was 50% off. So I got an additional 50% off so I only paid 25% of what the original price for fleece is. So that was a really great deal. I got 0.8 of a yard for um, a little over $2. So that is a really great deal. Um, not sure what I'll do with it but it was too cute to pass up. And the other remnants I got are flannel. Um, like I said, I need them for making cloth diapers. And then also, it is such a low price that if I need to practice a project or something, this is perfect fabric to use for that. So the first one has like pink monkeys or something on it. I'm not sure. Um, not really my style, but it is a full yard, regular $6.99, so it was on sale for $2.09 a yard, and then I got half off of that. So I paid $1.05 for an entire yard of flannel fabric. So that, in my mind, is definitely worth it. The next one is another full yard of flannel, and it was regular $5.99, so it was on sale for $1.79 a yard, and so I paid $0.90 cents for this yard of fabric. And then the next one is this blue flannel, 0.444 of a yard, and let me see if I can do the math really quick. Um, I paid $0.37, cents, I believe, for this. So yeah, those are just incredible deals, and you can't pass up those kind of savings. So now on to other things that I got. Ugh, there's a lot. Um, I believe I mentioned, no, it's an upcoming video. I mentioned that I need more purple in my stash. So I grabbed this little pale purple chevron. I already have a purple chevron, but it's all different shades of purple. So I just went ahead and grabbed this one. It was 50% off, and then I believe I used my 25% off coupon on this because it's the only thing I got it would apply to. So um, I don't remember how much it came to, but I got like a third of a yard. Uh, it really wasn't that much, and it's something that I wanted to add to my stash. Then next up is, this. let's see, the rest is all flannel. So... Um, I found this cute little woodland creature flannel. Um, no plans for it yet. It was just really cute. So I got one yard of it, and it was two oh nine for one yard, um, which is super awesome. I was a little surprised the flannels weren't quite as soft as I thought they would be. The ones at Hobby Lobby are a little bit softer, but then again, at these prices, I'm not going to complain. So, um... A lot of these I don't have plans for yet, but I'm sure I will come up with something, and even if I don't use them right away, it's still such good savings that I'm okay with hanging on to them for a while. So there's the woodland creatures. And then this next one I just thought was really cute. It has like a cityscape and has like the red telephone booth, little cars, trees, different things. Um, this one kind of made me think of like pajamas or something, so I got two yards thinking that maybe sometime in the future I can make um, like some lounge pants for Peyton and a pair of pajamas for like a 
a matching pair for like a doll or something so not really for sure but I went ahead and got two yards just in case so I would have enough to do whatever I decide in the future and then I got some fabrics that coordinate the first one is this adorable fox print um, Peyton has a stuffed fox that she loves and so when I saw this I knew I had to get it and make something for her so I got um, two yards I believe and then there was only like two-thirds of a yard or something left on the bolt I don't remember it was under a yard and so they asked me if I wanted to get the remainder of the bolt which would be half off like a remnant so I said absolutely I would do that and so I ended up with I, I believe it's like two and two-thirds of a yard um, so I paid 209 for the first two yards and then the other part was less than a dollar I forget <laughs> I forget how much it was but um, to go with this I got two yards of this and then I got a yard each of these coordinating solids that were $1.79 a yard and that's just because I'm not for sure what I want to do with this but just in case I decide to make something that needs coordinating fabrics I already have them so yeah and then the next one is my absolute favorite it's adorable um like I said Peyton has a stuffed fox that is her best friend so I found this fabric that is a little girl with a balloon and she has a little fox friend who has a balloon tied to his tail and it is just the cutest print I've ever seen I've never seen this one before until I bought this fabric yesterday and it is just so so cute so I bought three yards of it absolutely no plans so far but I knew that since I love it so much, I needed to go ahead and get plenty of it. So, yeah, it is definitely my favorite thing of what I bought yesterday. And then last up is this huge amount of white flannel. And this is actually what I bought for the cloth diapers and things. Um the PUL which is the waterproofing fabric that I use for the cloth diapers that I make um, was given to me by one of you and it is yellow so in the past I have done like all sorts of colors for the inside of the diapers because no one's really gonna see it but um, since I was buying fabric specifically for diapers this time I decided to just go with white because white goes with everything and it'll look nice against the yellow and then if I have some left over it's a good neutral to have for other projects so I got eight yards of white flannel and it was a dollar seventy nine a yard so yeah um, there's a lot of it here but I will definitely go through a lot of it because it takes half a yard to make three inserts the way I do it and it takes half a yard to make two diaper linings so this will get used up pretty quickly <laughs> so yeah that is everything that I bought at Joanne Fabrics let me know in the comments what is your favorite this one right here is definitely my favorite and yeah I will be back soon with some more videos. I will see you all again later. Bye.